Hello Malcolm and hello everyone else. Welcome to episode 15 of Ascension. Alright, here we are on the balcony of the uh, Spellcaster Lady. We could take a quick look in our spell book. Um, yeah, so we can bind any of these first level spells. If we have scrolls thereof. Let's see what scrolls we've left lying around. Spare Light Heal, Charm, Bolt of Flame. Uh, Bolt of Flame, wouldn't that be nice, eh? Uh, I don't think you get that one for quite a while. Fireball. Bolt of Flame, oh wow, it's like way not happening. Uh, we left an orange potion behind. Be glad to take that, and I'll take one of these spare anti-poison potions too. We'll just do a little backpack reorganization. Dump those things in there. We've got our portico and the unknown key. And uh, we're looking for the portal. And we're going to pop down to British's chambers, where we've wrecked his mirror and his extremely toothy rug is waiting. Now we're going to run over to the Avatar's room and see if we left anything really useful. Wow, it's dark in here. Wow, I like the light effects actually. They're pretty cool. Did we leave anything good in here? No. No, this stuff is all junk. We're going to skip all that. We're going to skip all that. Now every time I pick up this headset that I'm wearing, I, I pick it up and I turn it a certain way and I put it on and slowly the cords just become more and more twisted. Speaking of twisted, there's only one person in this game who eats on a regular schedule. And there he sits. Greetings, Greetings Lord British. And somewhere... I don't remember where... There's something, I don't remember where. But somewhere, there's access to some personal space belonging to said lord. Uh, you know, I refuse to look this sort of thing up on the internet. I'm proceeding on past information. Either way, I said we'd visit some of the interesting stuff in the castle today, so we will. We'll run over here to the jail. We'll try our hand at the gate. It's open. We're gonna head down. This is pretty cool. Wow, I love it. Oh, you're the Avatar, ain't ya? What in the name of the virtues are you doing down here in this jail? Oh, I don't know. What's your name, guard? Let's be My formal name's here. Tyson. Do you have people locked up in here? Yeah, it's a jail, ain't it? Yeah. I get the worst criminals down here. Feel free to look around, but don't open up any of them doors. I gotta keep these people locked <clears throat> up. In fact, I wouldn't even recommend that you talk to any of them. I got one mental case in there that's a complete loon. As delusional as they come. And just where they belong in jail, eh? You know, I've got speaking... to go. Don't blame you. I'd like to get out of here myself. Speaking as a confirmed case on my own, and not even not even being facetious or light, I must say, there are a lot of mentally ill people in jail, and it's probably not where almost anyone belongs. Let me go. Go find the Avatar. He'll tell you that I am the uh -huh. great Lord British. I have ruled here it's in Britannia Richard for Garriott. generations. It's Richard Garriott. Oh no. We need to talk to him more. How can we get access to him to talk more? We can't. We're going to have to open the door. I wonder if we could kill the guard. That would be so wrong. Let's try this guy. Well, the worst criminals, eh? Let me out. Oh, why is my head hurting? Have you talked to my friend Shamino? He's uh, standing right near me. He'll vouch for me. Shamino, <laughs> say something. <laughs> Speak up. 
Yes, Lord British. Let him go. Yes, what we have there is a case of the beginnings of the schism in the Avatar's identity here. Psst. Hey, do you know Chuckles? He had a bit to drink, and I fear the bottle got a better hold of him than any woman ever could. <laughs> He'd let me out. <laughs> he would. Okay, we're going to try good old Gary at one more time. Trapped in his own game by schemes of his own making. The poor man. Let me out of here. I've been wrongly imprisoned. I am your sovereign. I am Lord British. I command thee to let me out of here. Okay, well, see, the thing is, I believe him. I actually believe him. Uh, whoa, what's this? Would you look at this? I had no idea. Let's just shut that behind ourselves, shall we? So the others cannot see. Ooh, five arrows. We'll have those. Powder kegs. We could totally blow ourselves up. Bread... More bread. Well, we could stand a loaf. Why not? We found the secret storehouse. Let's see what else Old British has to say. Hey, do you know Chuckle? Okay. We've hit a repeat on British himself. Well, Richard Garriott himself. Uh, do -do 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 -do. Oh, I shouldn't be doing this because I could end up doing a game breaker here. We'll save here. Uh, Let me out. Oh, why nothing is my happens. head hurting? Have you talked to my friend Shamino? He'll vouch for me. Yes, Lord Pretty. That's crazy. Hey, I told you not to do that. Uh, ha, ha, ha. It's not in your best interest to disobey orders from me. These criminals got to stay locked up for good. Understand? Oh, well. Should I take my warning and take my medicine like a big avatar? Or should I try to take Greetings, the guard? Greetings, avatar. Stop right there. Let me get a look at you. Oh, one hit kill. One hitter quitter. And we belabored him with our axe quite thoroughly. Yeah, I don't think we'll be trying that again. Uh, I think this was where we left off. We're not going to disobey the orders. Yes, we are. Hey, I told you not to do that! Yep. Okay, let's see what happens if we do it again some more. What's the matter here? Are we not speaking the same language? Are you deaf or just slow? Wow, he's Leave those really bars like... be! Stupid people coming down here making my life hard. Why ain't he out saving the world or something? What if I was deaf or slow? I mean, this right. guy's not very nice. I warned you three times already. Maybe being locked up yourself will get the point across. Hmm. We can't wreck our stuff here. Nice place you keep here. You're a jerk. There! Maybe that'll teach you to listen! Now get out of here! And don't come back! How he managed to do Stop that to right such there. a... Let me get a look at you. Such a fine individual as myself. We will find British's feedy hole. Yes, we will. We'll find British's feedy hole. It's around. Somewhere around here, there's a place where our dear Lord eats. And he eats like once a game day or something along those lines. It wouldn't be here. Lightning bolt! Oh. So we can actually probably bind that spell wonder what reagents we need. Well, we're going to go drop the scroll off and uh, check that situation out. Hey, we could get training. Ho oh, there, Avatar. Say, I hear that you repaired the Shrine of Compassion. That's first-rate work. You know, I still train others in swordplay. 
Care to take a lesson? Yes. It'll only cost you 300 gold. Yeah. Sure, I'd like some training. All right. You know, the thrust is a, lot is a of good gold, but it's limited. Let me show you what I call the hammer shot. Now, I don't know how you use these additional moves in the game. The three arrow thing that I know now, and this now ostensible hammer shot. Well done. You're a natural, you know that? Well, it was good working with you. I don't really know to how to use my job. Them. Farewell. Okay, we're going to cruise. Uh, can you teach me to use that? <laughs> that would be so wrong. Your wrists wouldn't support it. You know, basic physics. We don't know where this demon man eats. But we know he does eat. And we have a little something prepared for that eventuality, don't we? Oh yes, we do. And we won't be dropping it. Uh, there's many the dungeon to clear before the final betrayal. Enough said on the matter. We'll just head up here and drop down that scroll. We'll we'll take a look at what reagents are needed for it. So we'll hit spellbook. Fifth, we want first. Lightning bolt, black pearl, mandrake root, and sulfurous ash. Now I think we can come by all those things. So let's get our scroll out, drop it down. Love the way this works, really. There's our mandrake. There's our black pearl. Now we need to find some sulfurous ash. There it is. Okay, technically this ought to work. Hello there, I'm just using your things. It's F11 for Ignite. Oh, better check that mantra. Ort Grav. I heard a funny thumping noise. My dog is up. I hope that's not necessarily someone at my door. Um, well, some people have access, some people don't at this point, but, uh, well, the dog's being fine. Get these candles lit. My door isn't locked. Um, but I would have to get up and deal with certain people if they can. Now we're going to try and get lightning bolt bound on here somewhere. Uh, did that work? Yep. So we're going to get that bound on our... Uh, thingy basler whopper here. Maybe we will put it down at F10. No, F9 is a good place, actually. So we'll just pop that back in there. So F6 through F8 are healing potions, and F5 is a healing spell. And then there's a nice space between F3, or F4 and F5, so that's good. So F9 has a space before it, so we're going to try to bind that spell onto F9 if we can. Okay. Well, looks like we succeeded. So now we've got Lightning Bolt bound. We're just going to save game on newest. You know, if we do a Game Breaker, we're in so much trouble. Let's go test that spell out. I wonder how mana regenerates, if it regenerates over time or whatever. Let's just cast it off into the night here at the roof of that house. Uh, no. Wow, that's pretty aggressive. It doesn't cost much mana either. Let's try that mirror. Oh, that's really quite awesome. So now we'll see how mana regenerates, if we have to potion up for it, or, uh, or what the story is. Uh, that's all good. Just gotta watch that mana level, and we gotta find the portal back. I hope we didn't hurt anyone with our experiment. And we'll just head on out. Maybe it only regenerates when you sleep. Let's, uh... Drink Lord British's bottle of gin. That doesn't give us any mana. But it feels like mana. It feels like mana. You know, there was a time in my life when I would actually drink 
Shin long ago. I I actually sought out and consumed Jin. I I don't know why. It's it's really not a pleasant substance to take into your body in any way. Okay, we didn't find what we were looking for there, but we did get a spellbound. Now let's check these bags. They're well stocked. We've got a few too many anti-poison potions. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and only one portal. Mm -hmm. I love the way people hum and whistle in this game. It's just a gentle reminder to keep on moving. Oh, I was so happy the music was stopped there. Okay. So we're holding on to that sword and our poison bread. And we've got a couple of gems to sell, so if we can find the gem seller, that would be a definite point. We feel well equipped, we do. F9 is a vicious blast. Our mana is reduced, and it might be there's no way to recharge it, but... Well... Potions are sleep. So we must regard it as a very limited resource. I wonder where the gem cutter is. That's the apothecary. That's a pond. Let's just hop. Oh, gross. We're in a swan pond. Can you imagine what a pond with swans and ducks and stuff swimming in it would be like after a while? Just, oh my god. Yeah, exactly. Someone's coughing as we approach. I'm not surprised. I know I'm just zigzagging through town like a mad creature. I just... You know... Cut me a break, I suck at this. There's the pub. There's the guy that's gonna try to kill us. Oh, let's try. Oh, that was sorta cool. End of him, eh? Yeah. Oh my. We do feel grand. Yes, we do. We do feel grand. We may still be naked. And I am going to seek us out some suitable armor if possible. I'll do my best on that. I don't seem to have any chance of finding the jam cutters. Are they down by the beach, perchance? Let's just head past the apothecaries and... This is... What? Are you kidding me? That is remarkably satisfying. Remarkably. We're definitely cutting into our mana power now. That's pretty great. I wonder if it'll work on those giant crabs. Okay. That's the castle over there. We've come the wrong way. Greetings. Greetings to you. I am so sorry, guys. I'm lost in Britain. I mean, is this stuff labeled on the map? No. No, it isn't. We'll just head on along our way. Ha 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 ha. We do feel grand. <clears throat> We've got enough mana for a couple more of those blasts, I would say. Or at least one. We could pick up more arrows. How many do we have? Oh, we have 600 arrows. I don't think we need to pick up any arrows. Except free ones. Let's climb that fence, step on that chicken. And we'll take that free arrow. Ha 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 ha. I'm not going to find it, guys. I'm not going to find it. I'm going to leave town and just hang on to those gems. Where do we go next? Well, I have no idea. Maybe we should have talked to British about repairing the shrine. What does he know, though? What does British know, eh? We, didn't, we don't need to worry about him right now. Uh, there is pause... There's the first dungeon to the northeast of us. So I'm going to assume that's the second dungeon to the west in the 
mountains. Oh my god. That is a bit harsh. And there's a town to the northwest. So if we strike out west and then north, we should be able to reach a town. And maybe there will be some different goods and some other stuff there. So we're going to really try to do that right now. And it is a shame there's no horses in this game. We're going to flee most combats. Uh, should we have struck north already? We'd better just quickly check our map in a safe moment here. We should be striking north very shortly. Like now. Mm, that'll just lead us to caves, won't it? Mm, check the map. Oh, having a little trouble checking the map. I think my mouse batteries are getting low. Uh, it looks easiest right now, doesn't it? I'm not even sure if that is a town. We're going to end up crossing through the mountains here. Okay, this fellow's on us. We felt him. His gold is not readily visible. We're going to continue. Oh, we're going to keep traveling this way. No, we're heading west too much. We really do need to head north. I hear footsteps. Yeah, we need to head north before we get to the bigger mountains. Those trees could block our path quite easily. However, we can avatar up a good portion of this slope. And then we're looking at relying on climbing implements, of which we did not bring a plethora. <laughs> no, we didn't. Uh, I should have realized there'd be some mountaineering involved here. Maybe we can find another way, eh? Whoops. Maybe we can find another way to cut north. Oh, this all looks very difficult. I don't think this takes us anywhere. It's obviously somebody in here. Oh. And you still can't pass here. Oh, yes you can. Okay, so we're back down in here. Well, maybe this will take us out where we want to go. Love the sound of flowing water down here. That's really cool. It's really neat. Yeah, we're gonna head up. Fortunately, the spiders don't seem to have returned. There we go. Okay, we're up here. Where is this? Ah, so we want to head directly north from here, really. And there is an orc. He hasn't picked up the battle axe. Wow, there's a few orcs and we got tagged. And our camera's going on jumpy. We'll use light heal. We want to head north. Hmm, hard to get around these mountains. Oh, it's the orc camp again. Oh my god. Hmm, yeah, this could be packed with orcs. The super orc isn't back, at least. Okay, well, north is where we want to go. I'm going to try to get up these 
rocks. Uh, no. Okay, I might resort to climbing implements here. Probably I could get up these by going some other way, eh? Okay. I should be keeping a belt space free. I should be definitely keeping a belt space free. I'll just pull one of my mana pouches. Oh, drat be doodle. Okay, let's see if we can get our gemstone back. No, nope, gemstone's left there for future times. We're going to head north. Oh, it's this icy area. Oh dear, eh? Oh dear, oh dear. And we want to go north, do we? Oh, this is the area I thought looked like a town, but actually, if yes, if we head northwest, we'll be on course. Just gonna have to be careful. I heard somebody get nasty. Oh. My dog is jumping up and running. I don't know quite what's going on. We're going to take this perch on the rocks and have a little look-see. Oh, I see this fellow now. We might be able to get a shot on him with the bow. He looks like he might have a bow. Oh, I've got a visitor here at the house. Uh, it's okay, they can take care of themselves. I'm just going to take this fellow on. He looks quite dangerous. Alright. Well, if I can beat this guy, I'll just leave things at this combat. And I'll go feed my fire and return to you guys for episode 15. This guy is not going to die from my repeated arrow blows. Not by any stretch. So I might leave you guys with both of these hideous creatures here. Oh no, the spider dies on one blow. I might leave you guys with both of these hideous creatures here. I'm just going to save game at newest. And I hope you're all having a good day, evening morning, whatever it is where you are, and I will see you all next time for episode 16. Talk to you then. I better save again. I'll just double save, and see you all later. Bye for now.